Sup, and good day, gamers. A formal bust here with a story about my uncle, a first impression. Not my uncle, but apparently the uncle, uncle of whoever made this game, or the uncle of the character in this game. But first, we have our sponsor, H2O, dihydrogen monoxide, agua, water, drink it up or die. Mm. Oh, cheers, gamers. Now let's get into this. <laughs> Story about my uncle was released back in May of 2014, developed by Gone North Games, and published by Coffee Stain Publishing. Its description on Steam is, A story about my uncle is a first-person platforming adventure game about a boy who searches for his lost uncle and ends up in a world he couldn't imagine existed. It's tagged on Steam as Adventure, First Person, Parkour, and Single Player. Retails on Steam for $14.99 United States dollars, and as far as I'm aware, there is no DLC. Main menu. Nice main menu, got... Audio, when you scroll over stuff, kind of tells you what's going on. Uh, not going to click new game yet. Level select. I. This is worrying. On I mean, it's a $15 game, but like this is how many levels there are. I wonder how long each level is. That'll be interesting to see. Extras. Time trial. I guess it's locked until I unlock it. <laughs> uh, continues, of course, locked. Options. Audio. Nice, normal, standard, got subtitles, voice volume, music, sound. The, the annoying thing about the whole sliders in this game is, yeah, they only move by fives, or at least this one does, and there is no, like, arrow on either end, and you can't, like, scroll them or anything. It'd be nice if you had, like, arrows or something to be more specific, but it is what it is. Video options. Motion blur. Yes, you can see the screen behind me kind of flickering. Motion blur I don't think changes anything, but... Changes happen immediately once you click on them. Like, if I were to click full screen, immediately go into full screen. Oh, I should put a... Let me just put V-Sync on. It'd be fine. Uh, field of view. Very nice. And this is what I like about the main menu. Uh, the options menu. Look at that. As you change your settings, the screen behind you changes. Very nice to see in a game. Let's you get a rough idea of what you're changing. And uh, this is it for video options, but there's more. Got your gamma. Got my bloom, which I have disabled. Detail level. Again, these sliders, which... Okay. Yeah, only go low to high. All right. That okay. Interesting option there to do sliders. Texture quality high. MSAA 8x. So, excuse me. Very good to see. Input options: mouse sensitivity, mouse smoothing, invert look, controller rumble. If you have controller, controller sensitivity. Very nice to see. Controller layouts. You can even see your controller layouts. You got a stick. Oh, they just have southpaw and reverse. Okay. Well. That's that's okay. Uh, and then rebind keys. I assume if I had a controller plugged in, I might be able to rebind, but I'm not sure. So don't take my word for it. And unlockables. Unlock modifications by gathering Fred's readings in game. Unlock the first at ten, and a new one, a new one every five after. You have collected zero. So I don't know what these do exactly. Uh, oh, changes the color of your beam in game. I guess I could then change that. Goat mode doesn't tell me. Okay, so there's different modes you can get by playing the game. Seems nice enough. Um, language. Uh, <laughs> yeah, game needs to be restarted. A lot, a lot of games do that. All right, English, German, French, Italian, Polish. I don't know what this is. And they even, look at this, they have be uh, beta ones. Spanish beta, Portuguese. I don't know how beta these are. This game has been out for a while. I'd like to have seen these done, but maybe this is a recent update where they're adding these betas in. Either way, it's nice to see the option for it. And let's just go back. All right, uh, that's all your options. And that's it. Let's get into a new game. Dad? Aren't you sleeping yet? It's time for bed, honey. Dad, I can't sleep. Can you tell me a bedtime story? All right, what do you want to hear? Something, something about an adventure. Hmm, I think I know just the thing. When I was your age, my biggest dream was to follow my Uncle Fred on one of his adventures around the world. One day, he disappeared. Okay, right into it. All right. WSD, mouse to look around, very good I tutorial. I stepped into the lobby of my uncle's house. It lay just across the hill from where I lived with my mother, your grandmother. She had tried to keep me from going, but... I wanted to see. 
see if Fred was home yet from his latest adventure. Call liars. Talk about fun time hair. Scary game. Okay. Tomorrow I have left for a spontaneous journey. See you soon, Fred. Okay, so he left but intended to come back. I like how everything's pretty simple, but yeah, it definitely looks very nice. Very, very nice. Hmm. Oh, I guess this wasn't originally an English game. Nice to see. I'm going to assume by that long word at the top that it is probably a German original game or maybe Icelandic, possibly. This door, you're ajar. Can I? I can't. Okay, it's just ajar for reasons. What's this? Do not forget, protective gear is important. Turn off turbine, oven, reactor, and lights. Well, his lights are on, so that's worrying. Ooh, nice runner. Oh, wow, they even did the runner holders. That's a nice detail of this. Very nice. Extra. To which alert... That which alerts us. Study on matter and its meaning for universal life. Okay, so a lot of storytelling through the scenery. I like this. Forensic science. Okay. He climbed that... We climbed that cave for days. A petrifying journey. And another that which uh, alerts us. Interesting. Okay, let's get upstairs. Beautiful, beautiful painting. More note, I'm gonna, mm, this is gonna hold me up. H2O plus V. H2O, baby, drink it up. And I don't know what V does, but maybe not. Organisms multiplying equals sign of new life. I mean, yeah. Grappling hook, no red, green light. Okay. <laughs> I, okay, all right. All right, uh, YouTube, go watch that maybe. I don't know what that is. Uh, let's hope it's not a Rickroll. This is important. X plus X squared equals... I think that's... No, that's not delta. Oh, gosh. My math is failing me. And I can't even read the power of... Okay. Important math. Ooh, a bat... Bolt of lightning batteries. It's nice. Okay, what do we got here? Ooh. It has been a long... Uh, that one's too hard to read. Oh, here we go. Dear Frederick, old friend... Said, oops, okay, again, different languages, I can't read this, sorry. Oh, to Uncle Fred, maybe that was drawn by me, maybe. New invention ideas, automatic toaster, time travel car, okay, he's got a time travel car, but, okay, whatever, and disposal system, go. Pad lights up, th pad lights up, things disappear, where do they go, starting to, okay. Don't forget, turn valve, okay, this, this is great. A lot of little Easter eggs. Um, yeah, I'm taking screenshots, y'all. I'm taking screenshots. Deal with it. Oh, another watch thing. Definitely, definitely. It's it's fine. I'll, I'll look at this later. But yeah, lo lots of little Easter eggs in here. I'm, lo I'm loving all these little Easter eggs so far. Remember, respond to Nathan's letter. Something about lost treasures. What's that? Particle emitter botched. Where are th they? I, I, I can't. I can't tell. Cool, cool, cool. Movies to watch. Star Wars 4 to 6, The Matrix, Clockwork Orange, Schindler's List, Dear John. Okay. Good list there. Good li I don't know what Dear John is, but those others I am aware of, and they're good. More stuff. Oh. Q okay. That might come and help later. That's for me. More math and stuff I don't understand. What is this? Folklore Magazine, Monsters of the Modern Time. The readers share their stories. Okay. Oh, man, he's got a bit of a mess up here. Now that I get into it. What is some tool, I think? Ooh. Okay. Okay. Okay, Daddy's Helmet. Nice Bioshock reference. And actually, no, in there it's just a uh, glass reflection. Nice. Daddy's Helmet. <laughs> okay. Ooh, Explorer reaches top of mountain at age 52. Nice. New species of bacteria found during science fair. Okay, kind of an otherworldly, oh, this doesn't seem safe, but whatever. It's not just a fully wood building, it's just keep gas canisters and stuff. Ooh, oh, that, great, y'all, you gotta play it, you gotta play this game on your uh, uh, Game Boy, yeah, old classic Game Boy, yep, it's apparently on there. Oh, I can interact, but let me look first, log into Galapagos, oh, little, I guess, oh, pens where he's been, cool, very well traveled, um, Good plan, not going to Russia. Good plan. Iraq, though, oh, man. wonder what year this... Well, this is 2014, so who knows. 
And Grand Canyon card. All right. My uncle used to send me postcards from his long journeys. Greetings from Nepal, Galapagos, Kilimanjaro, the Amazon River. This was the first time he had left without a word, without sending cards. See you in another life, brother. Your brother. Okay, maybe, maybe his other brother's dead. Okay. So, definitely a walking simulator, it seems so far. Nice one, though. Nicely well fl uh, flushed out. Flushed out, flushed out, flushed out, I think, is it? Okay. Lighting, too. Although, yeah. Okay. Oh, wow. Oh, it's snowing! Came here in the snow and didn't even make a mess. Okay. It's a weird building. I guess he's building his house is on stilts or whatever. Fantastic Frederick's Disposal System. Oh, this is what he's working on. Sweet name, logo, FFDS. Platinum bolts, hydraulic overloader. Okay. This is cool. So, inventor and traveler, my uncle was, apparently. Interesting. He has a weirdly laid out house, but I'm not knocking it. I like have visited Uncle Fred's house countless of times. But in the locker, which usually was closed, I found something I hadn't seen before. It was an adventure suit. It resembled the one that Fred used, but smaller in size. Okay, cool. Now let's grappling hook, water cooler or cool water. Water cooler or cool water. Great. Okay. Grappling hook. Wait. <laughs> MP3 pocket. Not really necessary. Yeah, I, I would say so. All right, let me. Curiosity got the better of me, and I tried it on. It fit like it had been custom made for me. Okay, cool. Ooh. Oh, I got a band aid on my finger. Nice little detail. I just. Yep. What was that noise? Sounded like something. Else. Maybe it was just my suit moving. Okay, I got a suit. Men on the moon, touchdown, successful flag planted, rocks collected. Okay, cool. It's got history buff as well. And some stuff that's up there. Yeah, I'm not going to read it. Okay, where's this go? That weird the room. The most mysterious room of my uncle's house was the observatory. There he kept his newest experiments. And right now it held a pad used for disposing of garbage. <laughs> Uncle Fred had warned me not to touch any of his things. But, as I said, I was a curious child. Welcome to Fred OS version point, version 0 0.03, poorly levered to launch. Alright, I'm just going to point out, this is a bad observatory. I mean, I guess it would work. You'd just have to... You'd be so annoyed by using a telescope in here for the things. And nice to look through, though. Yeah, definitely. All right, pulling a lever for a garbage disposal. This seems totally fine. Totally fine. Okay. Okay. S starting pad. Uh, oh. Finding target. Okay. Opening dome? Oh, wow. Okay. Oh. Okay, I'm just pulled right into it. Okay. This seems fine. Oh. Oh, well, guardrails there. Okay. And I can't look around, so I'm just being launched. All right. There we go. Sorry about Michael. So I know I live, because apparently I'm telling my child, I assume, in the future about this story. Just glossing over the whole launching into space with no... Oh. Okay. All right. I landed with a crash, but thanks to the suit, I wasn't hurt. I had no idea where the pad had taken me. Oh. But back then, I didn't care so much about where I was going or how I would get home. Oh, is that? Okay, floating rocks right off the bat and a weird thing that light bulb may... I don't know. This is interesting. Can I jump? I can jump. Can I? Yeah, floating stones. Okay, cool. There's an, oh! Foliage noise as you walk through. Nice. Okay. Alright. Did he leave me any notes here? If if he went here. Oh! Okay, so I can't zoom anymore. Right button does that weird thing now. So, okay. Some ramen. Some, fo some food supplies. So good. He came prepared at least. Some garbage. Oh, well... Garbage disposal does job, I guess. 
Okay. That's... Oh! Maybe he tried to invent or had some... Ooh, briefcase. Can't open it. Alright, just go down the bridge, I guess. Hey! I can run! Okay. Yes. Ooh. Oh, save point! Little save points here. Nice. Glyphs actually do something. They're not just pretty glyphs looking. The suit protected me from falls on the ground, but not in water. Mm. I couldn't swim with this thing on. Best be careful. Okay. Storytelling as... Ooh! Ooh, that was close. Maybe I should have run more? I don't know. Nope. Okay, gonna have to use the little ledge here. So my jump is limited. Alright. This is trippy already. Oh! Hold right to mouse button to charge up the suit and release a power jump. Okay, alright. That's how I get high. Way up high. Alright. I was sure that someone had been here before me. Someone had built these bridges and carved these symbols, but who? Where were they now? Okay, so charge up the suit and release while sprinting to power leap. Sorry. Oh, this is not good. This is not good. Well, first death. Here we go. Charge up the suit while re Okay, so... Oh, I gotta... Okay. You gotta use it while looking at... Okay, there we go. There we go. I don't think it really matters where I'm... I found a strange gizmo. Some sort of measuring tool that Fred must have built. It seemed to be done measuring, though, so I took the results to give to Fred. Didn't take all the results, but I took them, so those are the collectibles, it seems. Ooh. Okay. Got moving, jumping things. Okay, this is... Okay. I have a feeling this is going to end up very bad for my character, but whatever. Okay, so I can make that jump. All right, now I gotta get there, I assume. Nope, not there. <laughs> uh, back to, yep, back to the save point, okay. Ooh, I really do stick these landings. Must have some sticky boots on this suit. Very, very important to time everything correctly, it would seem. Ah, no ledge grabbing, okay. I can't grab ledges, what a shame. I'm really loving the weird reticule. Oh boy, nope. Okay, so I have some movement in the air. Okay. Nope. <laughs> no double jump either. Like I said, not going great for me. Okay. Damn moving rocks. Really going to be the end of me, aren't they? Alright, wait until I guess... Yeah. There we go. Hey, there's a save point. Okay. I can go that way, which goes to an island, or I can go that way, which... We're going to go to the island first, because it seems like the way I'm not supposed to go. Gosh, I got to let go before I go off the edge. Okay. All right, this way. Oh, yeah, it even points you in the direction you're supposed to go. Okay. Weird symbol. Guess can't do anything with it. Anything over here? Oh, interactable things, I think. How did you know Fred had been there? Well, I found a small campsite where Fred must have slept before going further into the caves. I knew it was him because the place was littered with empty packages of his favorite hiking foods. Canned soups, tube food, and instant noodles. Hmm? Tube food? That sounds gross. Oh, well, it's not that bad. One winter, Uncle Fred and I went hiking into the mountains, and we were surprised by a blizzard. We were stuck in a small cabin for two days, and all we ate was tube food and cold canned goulash as well. Your grandmother was worried sick, but I thought it was all very exciting. Awesome mic bump coming in, gamers. Just gotta reposition your microphone every now and then. Okay, now I gotta get back. All right. Oh, no, I hit the... Okay, well, I'll go back to my save point, which... Yep. 
Okay. Oh, this bridge is fine. I wonder if he built the bridge or someone else did. Okay, so I've got a... Uh... Oh, thank you, save points. They're pretty generous here, but I assume later they will not be. <laughs> See, see, when they put extra stuff, I want to get up there. Nope. Wrong. Okay, so you can't jump and then use your mega jump thing. You have to only use your mega jump or only use your normal jump. Alright. Alright, gamers, we got this. No, we don't! <laughs> Little hiccup there. It's all good. It's all good. I'm fine. Like I said, I can't die. I tell the story in the future. Okay. Nope. 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 Okay, maybe I can't get on that rock. Shame. <laughs> I actually have to jump, gamers. You actually have to press the jump button at the correct time in this game. Okay, so can't get up there. It's too high. Get over there, though. That's where I need to go, I would assume. Yes, okay, and I'm sure I can make it. Yeah, I can totally make it. And there's a save point for me, perfect. Oh, hey, it's my reticule right there. I wonder, nope, it's just there, okay. Oh, glowing rock hovering. Let's see what this stuff is. The power core I found activated the suit's grappling device when I picked it up. It must have been left here by my uncle. Oh. Oh, nice. So you can kind of see where you've been. Oh, not good. Okay, so rather floaty after I do those. Okay. That's, yeah, I was about to say. Grappling makes everything easier. What's this? When you're in range to grapple, so not there. Okay, so just when I'm in range to grapple, so... Oh my gosh, this is so much easier than jumping, y'all. Save point, save point. Okay. Don't think I can get up there, but... The grappling okay. device left a sort of symbol everywhere I grappled. I noticed similar symbols already there in the cave. And I was getting more and more certain that this place was where Fred had gone. Man, Fred was a pro gamer. So few grapple points. Can I just... Okay, yeah. Alright. Oh, I do have... Do I have a grapple charge? No. Okay. By releasing right trigger. Okay, while grappling. Okay, okay. Oh, I see what it wants me to do. I know what it wants me to do. And maybe... So I got my charge, and... Nope. Okay, not that. All right. Oh! Oh, so I can only do it once, but I can grapple slingshot myself. Okay. Okay. Mm. Okay, I do have total control in the air. That's nice. Okay. Was there... There was something over there. Sorry, gamers. Oh, no, no, no. Oh my gosh, this is so, so forgiving with the grapple. Ooh, another collectible. Nope. <laughs> Save point was here, though. Okay. Yeah, I only got one charge. Maybe I get three charges later on the grapple. That'd be nice. Okay. Ooh, almost fell off there. Yes, combine... Yeah, combine jump power and grapple to reach higher areas. So... Okay, I see what it wants me to do. Okay, alright. Reach far off areas. Okay, so... 
The adventure suit was fantastic. By combining a power leap with a grapple, I could fly long distances through the air at great speed. Nope. <laughs> oh, man. Very linear, this game, but... I don't think that's really an issue of the game. Okay. Yeah, I definitely prefer the grapple. A lot more controllable. Okay. Nope. There we go. Okay. Grappling, a moving object you will follow along. Okay. All right. All right. All right. I got you. Oh, nope, no, no, no. A little further. Okay. All right. I guess it's just moving toward me, though. I lose grapple. Okay. I see where the save point is. I'm liking this. Okay, what is... Okay. Oh, okay. Yeah, and you definitely... Totally have your uncle's... Stuff to follow. And release. Nice. Yeah, these glyphs don't really tell me much, but... They tell me where to go, so that's very helpful. Oh. Well, that looks like a sad face, doesn't it? Sad, angry face with a helmet. My nope, not missing anything, I don't think. Save point, thank you very much. Okay. Uh short. And if I just follow along, I will get to here. Mm, okay, stick in the landing. Oh man. Oh, what is what is these things? Oh, they're just lamps again. Okay. I think I can make it to that place. Let's just uh charge up, run, and boop! There we go, and another save point. Okay. All right. Now this rock is probably what I gotta catch. I follow along. Oh my gosh. Okay, 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 okay. I see my exit. Oh my gosh. And we're good. And we stuck the landing, perfect. Oh wow, okay. A lot of fog in this game, which I guess they helps with your view distance stuff, but a little annoying. Oh, I do have a left hand. Okay. Again. <gasps> Another power core. <gasps> yes, I can grapple twice before landing because I have two power cores. Okay. Oh. Nope. <laughs> uh, I got a new power and I immediately die. Okay, there we go. <sighs> okay. Oh, the center light lights up when my jump is ready. Okay. Lit. Lights indicate how many grapples, so I have two. Okay. And I guess I just need a third power core. Okay. Where are we going? One. Two. No! Okay. That would have been fine if I didn't hit the rock. So, let's try that again. One. Two. Yeah, 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 I'm good. I'm totally good. Totally good. Okay. What's this? This is just another area you could have landed. Okay. All right. Perfect. I hear a. I hear a secret. Yep. Another data collector. And a save point, thank you very much. Okay, so it wants me to go this way. Oh my gosh. If this is this is too they're all too far. Okay. 
So take this. Then go to that rock. Oh my gosh. Okay, I see. The moving rock, not the other rock. Okay. And, okay. Ooh. Flying by the seat of my pants, or the glove of my hand. Give me that save point. Okay. Alright, now this looks like I'm going nowhere. Oh, darn it. Missed it. So, okay. Okay, this is one. Don't want to let go until I need to. Okay, 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 okay. Okay, nope, not that time. <laughs> Arm flailing begins, okay. Oh, nope, didn't get it. All right, okay. I need to wait until... There we go, okay. Ooh, boy howdy. And just, just a little further, just, just right there, okay. All right, another camp of his, something lighting up over here, ooh. Berries or Did something? Did you ever see any of Fred's experiments yourself? Yes, I actually helped him collect samples for his research sometimes. To learn about them? That's right. We found all sorts of things. One time, we went to the forest and found a small pool of water that was full of eggs. Eggs? Were there chickens in the forest? No, not chicken eggs. These were small and jelly-like. Hundreds of them. Fred told me that they were frog eggs. He was in for a surprise, though. Guess what happened? What? What happened? Well, we took some eggs back home, and one day, Fred woke up with bites all over his body. Turns out, it wasn't frog eggs after all. It was mosquito eggs. Ah, oh, poor Fred. I know. He did find real frog eggs eventually. He told me that they were very, very special, but I don't know what happened to them. I left them here. I didn't take them with me. What is... Okay, interesting. Nope, okay. I can make it. Oh! Sorry, there's a. Okay, no, I can't. Okay. Oh, these rocks. These rocks. These these are the crazy bits, but I see where I'm going. So. Don't let go. Don't let go. Oh, of course. Of course. Ah! Almost had it. Okay. One more time. Let's get it as it's going past. There we go. I'm gonna go up and yeah, there we go. It's not an exploit if the game lets you do it, right? But let's see what I missed back here, because apparently Fred went right over here. And nothing, just nothing. Okay, just the landing spot I was supposed to land on. Go this way. Oh, thank you, save point. I will probably be needing you, okay. All right, up and over, up and all the freaking way over. There we go, okay. All right, it's going nice. Oh, charge up and run and do. -doo. What do we got over here? Just darkness, dark corner. Hmm, these blue lights, did Fred put them here? Or was somebody else here as well? Good question. I like him. Oh, is that it? I guess that's it for the first level. <laughs> oh, okay. So I went through a cave. Oh, I don't have my... Tool. Oh, okay. So we, we're going to alternate between kind of walking simulator... The environment telling me stuff, and I guess my uh, jumping and grappling. That's cool. Oh, 
wow. Hello, who are you? You're not from here. Wow, you look just like Fred, but smaller and with less hair on your face. <laughs> she knew Fred. I told her that he was my uncle mm. and that I was looking for him. What's an uncle? I said that he was, that I had known him all my life. Really? Me too. I'll help you find him. I'm Madeline. The others call me Mad Maddie sometimes. I don't know why really, but you can call me Maddie. You've never been to the village, right? Let's meet over there in the square. I'll show you around. I bet you can get there easily with your suit thing. So, I'll see you there. I couldn't believe it. An underground village inhabited by frog people. Or more like salamanders. Either way, they, they walked like humans. They talked like humans. How was that possible? Okay, so I gotta get there. Well, okay, there we go. Okay. So now I gotta just start doing leaps of faith where it's just like, alright, run, jump, grapple, grapple, and stick the landing! Okay, oh man. Kicking up some dust when I land, nice. Yeah, all subterranean cave. Oh, there's the sky. We do get to see the sky. Save point, thank you very much. Okay. Mm. <laughs> okay, nope. Sorry, little girl, I died. <laughs> okay, alright. Another save point. Thank you. These save points... Oh, man. I don't know if they're going to get more spread out later, but right now I'm loving their regularity. Oh. Oh, come on. Come on. Okay, cool. So, that's how you climb over the edge, is you stick the uh, grapple onto the floor above where you are. Oh, what's this? I want to check it out. Little hut? Oh, yeah, I guess it's someone's little hut. Okay, so this is the village now. All right. Oh, so they got stuff from our world. Hey! Over here! Hi, welcome to my village. This is the town square, and that over there is Fred's tent. I haven't seen him in a few days, though. Maybe our elder Samuel knows where he is. He knows a lot of stuff. Mostly boring stuff, if you ask me. But it's worth a try. Before asking him, though, you should check out the village. It's not so bad. Unless you have to stay for too long. When you're done, go to the island with the windmill. And you'll see Samuel's cove from there. I'll go on ahead and tell him that you're coming. He's not much for surprises. Later! So we got Heisenberg chilling out in Madeline here. I oh. and agreed to meet her later. It was strange. How could I talk to someone who was not even human and still feel like it was perfectly normal? Okay, and there, Heraldry, it's almost the same as mine, but mine's got, you know. Oh no, it is. It's little fish. It's a fish. It's a fish. That's what it looks like to me, a fish. But theirs is rotated in their fins of the top and bottom, which are the side there, more implied. Can I buy stuff? Nope. Okay, they got tomatoes and zucchinis and stuff. And pots and pans and... Man. A sofa. Okay, so Samuel's been bringing stuff to them, it seems. Or his garbage disposal has been. And, oh, yeah. They even got corn growing. Okay, this is awesome. Shrimp. Oh, man. Eating fancy over here. Okay. Oh, okay, cool. They do have bridges. Let me just use the bridges then. Oh. Oh, nice. Even their own art culture. Okay. Looking for Fred's tent. 
Okay, this is... Okay, Fred should have told them how to store flammable liquids, but whatever. It's fine. I'm sure it's fine. Oh, wow, yeah. The fog? Okay. Must be an homage to something I'm unaware of. They even got fire, yo! Man. Humans, us spreading global warming everywhere, aren't we? Oh, uh, y'all should repair that. Seems to be a issue thing. It oh, there's the like windmill. Most of the shacks in the village were built out of trash. Trash from our world. It was, after all, a garbage disposal pad that took me here. Yeah. Uh. What's this up here? Just another little... Is this Fred's? It's empty. Fire. Home sweet home. Okay. I ain't gonna question it. I ain't... No, don't have any questions there. Okay. Oh, what's... This down from where it was, I guess? Okay. Just chilling out, watching their garden. Oh, yeah, I could have totally come down this way. Okay. And then I can go back up this way, right? Okay, cool, yeah. Oh. Okay. Guess just go up the... Is this the... No, that's the big spire. Okay. Oh. Okay. Oh. Did not see that hole there. Glad I didn't jump into it. Oh, wow. Yeah, they even got tools in there. Hammering away. Okay. Very slowly, but, you know, I assume you're supposed to just walk past them. Oh, hey, yeah, there's the actual symbol, yeah. Oh, save point, thank you very much. So... Where's the... There's the windmill. I want to check out what's over here, though, if anything. Nope, okay. Oh, I see. Okay, okay, I see. Oh. This is Fred. Okay, this is Fred's place. Okay. Advanced astronomy projects for amateurs. Okay. Oh, uh, oh, I see what he's. Oh, fish. Yeah, look, fish. I was right. It's a fish. So, yeah, he was totally trying to map their stars, which would. Oh, well. I mean, their moon looks similar to ours, but it definitely looks a lot different, too. So he's trying to map the stars to figure out where he is. That's smart. Yeah, that's smart. Ooh, he's got books. More gems and more stuff there. Okay. For how long had Fred been gone? I'm not sure. A couple of months, I think. Less than half a year for sure. I remembered hiking with him the summer before. But when I counted the days in his journals... And from when I last saw him, it didn't make sense. Maddie said that she had known him all her life. Maybe she meant it figuratively. Figure... Like, she didn't really mean it. Like, when you say you'll die if you don't get a puppy for your birthday. That's true, though. <laughs> I'm sorry. Of course it is. Hmm? Oh, yeah. Substance seems to have triggered the quickening of the eggs is a bluish crystal. Okay. With a fluorescent effect. I've seen fluorescent minerals before, but none that shines as bright as this. Moreover, to my knowledge, these minerals need to be exposed to ultraviolet light to emit visible light, which makes the crystal's luminescence a mystery. Vaguely remembers something about electromagnetic radiation having a similar effect. But that seems impossible in this cave. Why these crystals had an effect on the eggs remains a mystery as well. Oh, so the frog eggs ended up here. I made some experiments on one of the crystals I found, and it seems like they contain some sort of chemical energy that could be harnessed as electricity. I have yet to collect the materials for a proper electrical circuit, but my initial experiments are promising. Okay. Day five after arrival, me and the frog people... Have found a place to build a village. There seems to be plenty of fish, and the people are using my old trash 
It's filled makeshift shacks. I can't wait to start my research on their cave. This is the discovery of the century. Yes, it is. Day five. 4K 42 days after arrival? That can't be right. Whatever. Examine the creatures in almost every way I can. I've documented their habits, their appearances, and their behaviors. I am getting close to a complete report, and I wish I could somehow share this with my scientific colleagues at home now that I find... Now that I think about it, maybe I could build a new pad that would take me home again. Okay, so, yeah, it's been here a while. Uh, 27 days after arrival, I named one of the little froglings Madeline after my old journey companion. I bet she would have loved this adventure. Anyway, the little frog lives up to her name. So curious and... In... Invent... Inventive? Uh, inventive, I think. Uh, eager to learn as well. She even asked me to teach her how to write. Okay. Fred really making a home for himself here. Nice to see. Running, running, and this is the way I... Okay, yep. Man, y'all need to fix your, your, your... I guess it doesn't matter. They can swim. Um, so I think... Yeah, windmill's down there. I want to check out what's up. What is literally up from me. Okay. Yeah, because if he maps the stars, he can figure out where he is in relation to Earth. Or if he, he was even in, you know, the same spatial area, um, star-wise. Because if, if if he doesn't see any of the same stars or, you know, can tra or any of the same... Yeah, if he doesn't see any of the same stars, he's way, way away. Alright, Red Windmill, here we go. Hey! That might be Fred, I don't know. Fancy, fancy lad. Mm, a, a, no, I was supposed to talk to someone here at the Red Windmill. Ah, uh, okay. Yeah, this looks leader-based kind of area. Madeline and Fred. Oh, they got a whole new language. I can't, yeah. Three little pigs and Maddie, okay. Did Fred have any kids of his own? Nope. Not that I know of. He lived alone. He didn't really have any time for a family, I guess. He was always away or busy with his inventions. He could be gone for months at a time. I never knew how soon I would see him again. Don't you think he felt lonely then? I think he was too caught up in his projects to feel lonely. It seems like he found new friends in the village though. Maddie seemed to be especially fond of him, taking after all that he did. Maybe Fred was like a father to her. She didn't have a real father, right? If she was born from an egg. That's right. That's another thing we had in common. Oh, so I didn't have a father. Did Fred have any kids oh, okay. of his own? Nope. Not that I know of. He lived alone. He didn't really have any time for a family, I guess. He was always away or busy with his inventions. He could be gone for months at a time. I never knew how soon I would see him again. Don't you think he felt lonely then? I think he was too caught up in his projects to feel lonely. It seems like he found new friends in the village though. Maddie seemed to be especially fond of him, taking after all that he did. Maybe Fred was like a father to her. She didn't have a real father, right? If she was born from an egg. That's right. That's another thing we had in common. Okay, okay, I got this. Oh! Sorry, Rock, you're pretty dusty, apparently. Okay. Nope! <laughs> oh, there we go. There we go. Okay. Da doink. And da doink. Okay. Alright, perfect. Oh, wow. That's not. That doesn't seem Earth like. Oh wow, what the A stranger in our halls. Welcome. Our name is Samuel, and we will do our best to assist you. Please tell us what brings you here. 
I told him that I was looking for my Uncle Fred. We should help. Do you know where he is? Fred left us without a word. If you aspire to find him, we can share with you a sacred crystal, a power core. Fred used their kind to power his suit. You can have it if you return our Fred to us. The crystal? Sweet! Madeline, that was inappropriate. Your help will not be necessary. The crystal is not for you to have. What? I want to help finding Fred. Why couldn't I? Please, Madeline, that is impossible. None of us may enter the chasms. It is too dangerous. Mm. What's the danger? If Fred can do it, so can I. I say this for your own protection, Madeline. You are forbidden from entering the chasms. Just because you're afraid of what's outside the village doesn't mean I am. I'm nothing like you. I'll never be. We apologize. It is true that we want to keep her safe. But she does not understand. Mm. Behind us is the power core. Take it and go into the chasms. Find Fred. And if you see Madeline, take care of her. Be safe. Okay, so Fred kind of... Once they started I felt a little oh. uneasy about moving on into the chasms. If it was too dangerous for Maddie, would it be safe enough for me? Yeah, so Fred kind of set these people up here, or these frog individuals here, and told them it's dangerous outside, don't leave. So he wanted to take care of them, I guess. Okay, I guess I go... I got three now, y'all! Oh no. Dos and Tris. Oh, okay. Oh boy. So I only get three. I feel like most of this game will be made a lot. Would have been made a lot easier if I had more than three, but we'll find out. Mm, up and. Oh, come on, come on, come on, come on, come on. Yeah. Yeah, Fred, I didn't need to hit that. I got the one down there somehow, and it totally was fine. Oh. Is it down? It is. It's right below me. Okay. And don't want to die. Okay. Another save point. Where? <laughs> Spinning rock? Okay, well, I see his... Nope! <laughs> oh, okay. Okay, oh, no, that's gonna... Oh, nope, nope, not at all. Hello. Death. <laughs> You really gotta time these. Oh. Nope. Oh, okay. Ha. See, game. I can exploit you. Another, another, another secret, another secret. I'm getting it. Oh, wow. Whole another tent out here with a nice view. Okay. All right, save point, thank you. Thank you very much. Nope. <laughs> Careful not to walk off the edge, gamers. It's a pro gamer move there. So, I gotta get somewhere over there. Okay. Nope, <laughs> did not time that right, okay. Okay. All right, I see where I'm going. Oh, just just barely gamers, just barely. Okay. Yeah, this is getting complicated. 
Can I cheat the game? Nope, nope, I can't. Can't get there. Okay. <laughs> oh, man. Okay. I wonder why they put this save point here. I don't see any reason you would need it. Oh, come on. Come on. It's right there. Ugh. Maybe I shouldn't just be blindly... No, no, no. What's the worst that can happen? I do have a bit of... Oh, Okay. Oh, come on. Yeah. I don't know why this game would be frustrating. Oh, no, I... Oh, well. Had it and then I didn't. Okay. I don't want to hit that rock. Okay. All right, all right, I got it. Okay. Darkness swept over me as I left the glittering lights in the village behind me and headed for the ominous shadows of the chasms. What? Oh, might be in the mission, hopefully. And it is. As I entered the chasms, it struck me how much darker it was in there. The shadows were black as ink, and although I tried not to be afraid, I couldn't help but shiver. Was it the darkness that frightened the villagers as well? Or was it something else? I hear you. I hear you. I hear it. It's a little side path. Or maybe just this for the secret. It might just be the secret. Oh, give me it. Give me it. Oh, yeah, it's very dark now. Okay. All right. Gamers, we've been going a bit. I'm going to leave it here. This game seems interesting enough. I might play... Well, most likely play more of it. Interested to see where the story goes. But yeah, pretty simple premise. You got to jump and a grappling hook and you got to find your uncle. Yeah, I'm going to leave it right here. Uh, I've been... Game's been fine. No issues running it. Um, yeah. Looks great for what it is. Um, very well done and executed. And I mean, just listen. Sound design's solid. And the m music they've had has been great. So yeah, if you want to check out a story about my uncle, feel free to. Um, I will, like I said, definitely play more of it. Um, but yeah, I'm going to leave it right here for now. Thank you for watching. Feel free to do all the stuff. I have been a formal bust. As always, take care and drink some H2O.